Okay, in today's tech video, I'm gonna show you guys how you can set up your PC without a Microsoft account. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys a step-by-step -step way on how to do this. All right, so once you fire up your computer for the very first time and you're getting ready to set up, you'll probably come to a screen that looks like this. And this is where you're gonna to have to uh, do something a little different. You're gonna bypass, uh, you know, clicking yes down here on the corner. What you wanna do is on your keyboard, you're gonna select Shift, F10. Okay, what you want to do here is on your keyboard, you see the FN and the shift, and then there's F10. You're going to want to push those all at the same time. All right, and then a command box will pop up, but if a command box doesn't pop up, try hitting shift and F10 only. Some computers are a little bit different in how they do that, but hopefully one of those steps will get the command prop to pop up. Okay, and then your command prop will pop up just like this. Okay, now you're gonna wanna enter in the following uh, command. It's O-O-B-E backslash B-Y-P-A-S-S-N-R-O. So that's bypass N-R-O. Okay, there's no spaces in there. You'll just run that all together and then you're gonna hit enter. Okay, now we're back on this screen here. Now it may look like nothing happened, but something did happen on there. Okay, go ahead and follow the steps. I'm in the United States, so I'll click yes. I do want the US keyboard, so I'll click on yes there. I don't want a secondary keyboard, so I'll click on skip. All right, now it's gonna check for updates. Okay, now it's gonna come back to this screen here where it wants me to name this device. Okay, so uh, since I am using this for a church, I have it named Sound Booth PC, but you'll name it whatever you wanna name it. And then we'll click on next. All right, now it's gonna do its thing. Okay, now it's gonna ask me to create a pin. So I'll go ahead and go to this screen here. Okay, now it's gonna ask you for all the privacy settings and I'll go ahead and just toggle all of these off. Make sure you go all the way down to the bottom and toggle them all off. Then click on accept. Now it's gonna ask you to customize your experience. I don't select any of those, I just hit skip. Okay, and then now it's gonna go through the setup process where it does all this stuff and gets everything ready for you. And that's how you set up a PC without using a Microsoft account. Hopefully this video was helpful. If it was, go ahead and click a thumbs up on it. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I make tech videos all the time. And I'd love to have you back in the next one. Take care.